Hello mommies, today let's see how to make lotus seed spicy snack that suits your whole family including your little toddler. You shall get these popped lotus seeds also known as full makana in any nearby supermarkets. I have taken 2 cups of lotus seeds. Take a dry pan and roast these lotus seeds in sim stirring continuously. It might take 5 to 10 minutes in sim. Make sure to stir continuously to avoid burnt spots. Fried for 8 minutes, white seeds have changed to mild golden color. Pop one into mouth to check if it's done. If it's not crispy or sticks to teeth, then fry for little more time. As you hear, it's so crunchy and so I'm switching off the stove. Immediately transfer this to another bowl to avoid overbrowning. Add a heaped teaspoon of coconut oil to a dry pan. Coconut oil can be replaced with ghee or butter, whichever you prefer. Let the stove be in sim throughout the process to avoid burnt spices. Quarter teaspoon of turmeric powder. Quarter teaspoon to half teaspoon of plain chilli powder depending upon your spice level. For variations, you can replace chilli powder with pepper powder. Once the oil is slightly hot, add the spice powders. I repeat, let the stove be in sim. The spices has to be fried well but not burnt. Adding quarter teaspoon salt now. Add fried lotus seeds before the spices darken. Stir well for the spices to coat all the seeds. Check for salt now and add more if required. It's perfect for me. Switching off the stove now. Transfer this to an airtight container. Once cool down completely, close the lid and keep it airtight. The snack will remain good and crunchy till the box is emptied completely. Protein rich, healthy and tasty snack is ready to munch on. When giving it to babies, dust out the excess salt and spices using a tissue paper as shown in the video. This can be given to babies after their first birthday. Before introducing this, make sure you have introduced puffed rice snack which is an easy crunchy snack to practice with. The link of puffed rice snack video is given in the description box below. Do not give this as a whole to babies to avoid choking. Cut into small sizes that your baby could handle. I am cutting for my 15 month old toddler. That's it. Transfer this to an airtight container. Discard the small bits. The healthy and handy snack is ready for the babies. Keep it airtight and offer whenever your baby points to. Always stay near the baby to control overloading into the tiny mouth. <coughs> Do try this and comment below how you and your baby enjoyed this snack. Thanks for watching. Catch you in the next video.